Hey guys, it's Mira here. So in today's video, I am going to show how to make these gifts. Using two different apps, which are the Autodesk Sketchbook or the Huion Sketch. Let's start. We are going to start with the Autodesk Sketchbook first as this is the application that I use in the beginning of my videos. Make a new sketch size 1280 times 720 as this is the size of our YouTube video. Then just make your background. When it comes to writing, I often use the pencil pal and also the paintbrush. So just write out whatever it is that you want. Then, add on another layer and the trick is to let the eye icon of the previous layer on and trace your writing. Your tracing shouldn't be perfect. Then, just repeat it again which depends on how many layers that you want. I will often make up to 2 or 3 layers. Now, it is time to save. Turn off 2 out of the 3 layers eye icon before you share in which it's just exporting the drawing into your gallery. Repeat this again with the other three layers. Then, open your editing app. The one I use is called KaiMaster. Then, import the three drawings in order and repeat until you think it is enough. What you are going to do next is drag the end of the clip to be 0, 0 0.100 second. I would just drag the clip until it is at the shortest duration. Once you have finished, it should look like this. Next, we are going to make a GIF that overlays our own clip. Open up Autodesk Sketchbook again. And the trick is, after making your layers, just turn off the eye icon of your background and then save each layers. I will only do two layers for this type of GIF. If you use KineMaster, click on the layer option, then click media. Import your drawing and adjust to your liking. What we are going to do next is split the clip into multiple clips and I will just eyeball the duration this time. Then, add the other media and also split the clip into sections, then rearrange the layers to make it look like it is a GIF. This method is very tedious, so I'm going to show you a simpler way. We are going to import the media and apply overall animation. Choose Blink Slow. And try to rearrange the second just so that it appears when the first clip is not present. This should look like a GIF. Next is the Huion sketch. Open a new custom canvas with the same dimension I shared before, which is 1280 times 720. And then, just like in the Autodesk sketchbook, I will show how to create a GIF with a background and one without the background. For Huion Sketch, I will often use the HP Pencil. It is just the same step, create new layers and trace your writing. But you can see how your animation will look like before you share, by clicking on the three vertical dots and choose Create Animation. You can also toggle with either you want it to be loop, ping pong or one shot. But I would just choose the loop. And you can also choose the frame per second. I will often choose 4 frames per second or 6 frames per second. You can even add another layer just by clicking on the plus button. Or you can duplicate the layer you like. Hold duration is just basically how long would you like to hold the clip before it moves on to the other clip. Once you are satisfied, click the three vertical dots again and share as a GIF. 
open your editing app and add the clip as media. As you can see, it is very short, but you can simply zoom in like this. Then drag the clip to increase the duration. Since it is loop, the GIF will loop until the end. This is how it will look like. To make a layered GIF, just simply repeat the steps before but close the eye icon of your background. However, as you can see, the layered GIF seems to lack the pencil texture, so just keep that in mind. I hope that this video is beneficial to you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Bye-bye. Stay safe wherever you are.